Hello, this is Ruth Warrington. In this training video, I'm going to show you how to log in and log out of your new Gmail account, which we created in a previous training video. So I've come to this home page of Google. I'm going to click on sign in. It brings me to the login page. I'm going to type in my email address here. So just double check that's spelled correctly. Then I'm going to type in my password. But for this training video, I'm just going to show you if I type it in correctly, what will happen. It's telling me that is incorrect. You have, I think it's about three attempts before you get locked out. If you do get locked out, don't panic. When you signed up, you would have provided a another email address for them to contact in the event that this happens and they will send a notification to that email account telling them someone's tried to access and you know they fail to do so you know please reset your password and that's how you would get back into your email account with gmail and that goes the same with the other um, email providers like hotmail and yahoo either they'll contact you via mobile phone like with a text or if not they'll send to an alternative email account so I'm going to type in my password correctly now you'll also notice down here they've got stay signed in if you tick that that means that the computer that you're working on will remember your email address and password this is okay if you're using your personal computer However, if you're using a public computer like in a library or an internet cafe, this is very dangerous. And that means that anyone can log into your account if they end up pressing like this back button at the top of the screen here. They can quite easily go back in or if not reload the page and your details like here will still be here and they can quite easily just click on sign in and get into your account. So always make sure that you click the untick button. I do this for my own personal computers just in case, God forbid, someone stole my computer they're not going to get easy access to my email accounts. So just double check that it's all ticked off and I click on sign in. It's now signed me in to Gmail. By default it always comes back to the home page. You'll notice that my email address is at the top here because it's just letting me know that I am still signed in. I click on Gmail And it's now opened up the Gmail account. And you see up here my email address is still up here. So that's how you log into your email account. So if you want to log out, a lot of people just click on the red box up here with the cross. Don't do that. You're just simply closing down that page. You're not actually physically signing out of your email account. The better way for security reasons is to click on your email up here and you click on sign out like so and that means you're officially signed out you see you've come back to the login page but my details are not here so that's how you log in and log out of your email account with gmail uh, please uh, subscribe to my channel and look for other free training videos on how to use email whether you're using gmail Hotmail or Yahoo. Thank you.